Good morning and welcome to Stardew Valley. It is Saturday, the 13th day of summer, and the fortune teller says the spirits are very displeased today. They will do their best to make your life more difficult. Okay. Oh, and it's raining again. Great. We don't have to water. Okay. Let me throw some copper in. Um, before I even get started, I want to say that in the last episode, I couldn't find Robin, and it's because she's a mad woman, and she was working on our farm. <laughs> but I don't think we would have been able to interact with her unless that changed in 1.6, because as far as I remember, you could never interact with her while she was working. So that's what she was doing and why I couldn't find her yesterday. Okay, and we have some mail from her. Thank you for purchasing a coop upgrade. In addition to doubling the capacity of your coop, I've taken the liberty of installing an incubator. To use the incubator, simply place an egg inside. If you have space left in your coop, the egg will hatch in several days. As always, thanks for your business. Okay, so I'm probably going to throw an egg in there right away. And I also want to grab an egg because today is Alex's birthday. I hope. I hope I didn't mess up the birthdays again. I'll say hello to everybody. And we'll put extra... Oops. We'll put extra hay in the trough. And I'm going to throw one of these eggs in the incubator. Um, do I have a... Yeah, there. There's a silver one. And we'll grab one for Alex. Um, maybe I'll give him a gold one. And before I forget, I wanted to take the bait, which I've lost again, and throw it in the chest over here so that if I forget it, I don't have to run too far. There we go. Okay, so let's pick what we've got here. Got some peppers and some blueberries. Squash. Oh, full inventory. Oh, actually, let me take that squash. We might have some recipes or something that I can use that for. So let me throw that in the house. Oh, silly me, I don't have a kitchen yet. Okay, squash, blueberries, pepper. I'm going to save the periwinkles because I have a feeling that I might need them for something. And also, I'm going to unclick the show flash effects. One of the things I wanted to do today was get a barn. But I must have used up all my wood for the coop upgrade. So let me see if I can figure something out here. Ooh, I'm running very low on coal. Okay, so let me put these copper away. First thing I want to do is... I was going to say run to Pierre, but I'm going to run down to Marnie. Marnie. 
No, I'm not. <laughs> yes, yes I am. That's right. I want to buy a duck. And then I want to run to the beach and get all the forage. And then to Pierre to buy some more seeds. And I know I still have my melon seeds to plant. Okay, purchase animals. A duck. Go here. And we will name him George. And I'll try and remember to go pet little George before tomorrow. I've heard that the more you check the garbage, the better the finds are. I'm not sure how true that is, but I'm going to keep checking. Okay, so it's the uh, crab mating season, so we have extra forage on the beach. Ooh, nice rainbow shell. Creepy guy. Okay, I'm going to take this right to Willy. I wonder if I need a sea urchin for any reason. I don't don't need it for the community center, but I'm going to hold on to them just in case. So now we're back up over 7,000. So from Pierre, I want to buy some hops. I know it's late in the season, but uh, I want to make sure that I get a few for whatever it is that they make when you put them in the kegs. And we'll stop by and see Alex and give him his egg. Okay, do I have anything for... Yeah, I don't think I have anything that Evelyn and George like. Okay, we have something on the board. Sebastian needs a sunfish. 90 gold, oh, and a, and a prize ticket. Okay. Okay, so we'll get a couple of hops. I know we're not going to get much out of those, but that's okay. And I want to buy some more melon seeds. So they'll be ready by the 25th. I've got 12 already. <laughs> okay, we'll make it 20. And now I don't have enough wood for the barn yet, so let me run home real quick. I might not be able to get my barn from Robin today. Let's see. I'll try taking down some trees. Ooh, I just got a book. 
What a secret. You learned a new power. Felled trees have a 5% chance to yield double the wood. Oh, wow. That was a nice time for me to get that. I read it so quickly that I didn't see what it was before I opened it. Okay, I need 350 wood. I don't think I'm going to be able to get that today. Oh no. Especially if I let it go in the sh water. Yeah, I don't think I can, uh get this before Robin closes. But that's okay, I've got nothing else going on today. Got some moss. We haven't been over to this side of the farm lately, so I'll take a look at it. Okay, it looks like I have the wood I need. Let's see what's going on up here. This we said I, we needed the gold axe for, the uh, gold pickaxe for. And I'm going to let these trees grow. Because I'm always in need of wood. But I will take these big ones down. That looks like a little piece of coal. Yeah. Okay, and I want to take advantage of the rain and do some planting. I don't have much room over here. So I'm going to put some right here.
I'm going to run over and... Actually, do I have... Yeah, I have enough fertilizer on me to... I mean, sap on me to make fertilizer. But I have to empty out my inventory a little bit. Okay, hopefully this will help us to get some gold melons. And I still have some hops to plant. And we'll throw a couple melons down there. Some fertilizer. And let's see what I need for the quality sprinkler. Iron bar. Gold bar, refined quartz. Okay, I only have one refined quartz. I forget how much quartz it takes to make a refined one, if it's five or if it's one. Uh, let's put some stuff back in here. The wood and the stone we don't need right now. Okay, it only takes one quartz. Great. some eggs while we're waiting. Well, I can make one. Go put it down just in case the uh, the other one won't be ready in time. Hey, 
There we go. Oops. Okay, I think I got everything done today that I wanted to do. I just have these few melons to plant, but I don't mind staggered. Um, let me just, oops, try and pet the dog. There we go. Okay. Seventeen, seventeen gold. That's not bad. Okay, it is Sunday the 14th of summer. Fortune teller says, Spirits are somewhat mildly perturbed today. Luck will not be on your side. Okay. Queen of sauce. Pancakes. And the weather report, just for fun, clear and sunny all day tomorrow. Ooh. Got a lot of blueberries. Uh... Okay, from Pam, my throat's about as dry as a desert bone. I'm real thirsty for a pale ale. You got one? Regular old beer won't do. Okay, we'll accept that. And is that the uh, hops? If it is, I, I'm glad I bought it yesterday. All right, let's grab all these blueberries. Looks like my star fruit is ready, close to ready. Got some squash. Yeah, and the star fruit. So I'm going to throw a melon seed right down into that empty lot from the star fruit. Put a little fertilizer there too. There we go. Okay. I should really go into menu when I think. <laughs> okay, blueberries and squash away. I'll sell the gold ones. Star fruit, I'm gonna save. Oh, that's a gold star fruit. Hmm. We'll see. Maybe I won't save that. Okay. Let me say hello to everybody. I forgot to say hello to George last night. <laughs> Harder than it needed to be. I almost forgot. Bait. And my watering can.
So hopefully today I can run to Robin and get the barn going. First, let me take care of these strawberries. Excuse me, blueberries. <laughs> Okay, let's start watering. Okay. All right, now we'll run down to the traveling cart. something that I might need if I don't get pigs in time. Oh, purple mushroom. <laughs> Some of these do tempt me. Um, let me run into the secret forest and see if there's any purple mushrooms in there. Kind of a lot. No, I think uh, I think that's too much money for a purple mushroom. And the truffle oil is definitely a lot of money. I'd love to stay down here and take down some of these trees, but I want to get to Robin on time, and I just noticed how late it is. I don't have my wood and my stone with me, so I'll run back home, grab those. And we'll run up to Robin. Okay, construct farm buildings. Barn. And we're going to put it right next to the coop. Actually, maybe I'll leave a little space in between so I can run up to the uh, crab pots. Okay, there we go. And, oops, I see some of these. Summer squash seeds. And I saw something up here. Coal. Ooh, coal. Let's see. I don't know how far down I can get, but I think I'll run into the mines and see if we can get some coal and also some resources for sprinklers. I think it's like not a great luck day today, but...
Oh, we have an open stairwell already. That's nice. Before I got hurt. Oop. something to eat. Okay, I'm on the 94th floor. I would like to get a staircase if we can. Looks like I'm going to be busy for the next little while though. Okay, it's after 10 now. Let's see. Oops. Keep forgetting it's two strikes per rock down here. I didn't even look over in this lower left to see if there's an open stairwell, but there's one of those uh, jinxy guys over there.
Ah, and he gave me a stairwell. 95. Very nice. Okay, let's see. All right, we'll bring all that home with us. I'm very happy with what we were able to accomplish today. Visiting the traveling cart, cutting down some trees, or maybe the trees was yesterday, and getting the barn started. Ah, uh, this dwarf scroll. Ooh, Gunther hasn't seen it yet. Great. He's seen the ruby and the topaz. Put that in there for Clint. Okay. I better head to bed. Thanks for being here. I really appreciate it. I hope you're enjoying these extended episodes. I'm going down to two days at a time. So I hope you join me again. Until then, stay safe and take care. Bye-bye.